So what's the deal? You tell me. You're the one always complaining about your wife. Thank you. I mean, one thing is not liking her. Another thing is killing her. I don't know. Killing someone seems a little excessive. But if she's nagging you nonstop, what other choice do you have? I mean, she nags here and there. There's no reason to kill someone. It's not murder if nobody knows you did it. And I know just the person to pull it off. How much? $100. Not bad. He's good. When I tell you no one will know, I mean it. I've seen it myself. And you don't ever have to worry about anything again. You're a free man. You get to wipe the slate clean. I mean, sometimes a fresh start does seem intriguing. But maybe, maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm just too impatient, too jealous. How do you know this is the right thing to do? I don't. But you just said it was the right thing to do. Listen to me. I'm listening. If there's a problem, I'm here to solve it with you. Yeah? No one's ever gonna know. What about God? What about God? Well, I will have to think about this. It's not a simple decision. One just makes from one minute to the next. You understand, Mr. Clark? I do understand. Thank you for your time. I respect your decision, Mr. Richards. Good man. Pretending you don't know why I'm upset. No, honey, I want to know what's wrong so I can try to fix it. He always pretended like he didn't know why I was upset. I was tired of it. Honey, what's the problem? She always wanted me to read her mind. I just wanted communication. Don't pretend this relationship is one-sided. You need to stop smoking cigarettes. I can do what I want. Ever since you bumped into that guy Jimmy at the bar, you've been a different woman. I am a different woman. You don't know me. I'm three-dimensional. You make no sense. You just need to communicate clearly what the issue is so we can work on it. Do you understand? You need to let loose. What the hell are you doing? I only promise to be with you until death do us part. I'm done with you. Frankly, I don't give a damn. Thank you for meeting me, Jimmy. No problem. I think my husband's trying to kill me. What would give you that idea? Well, there was a hundred dollars missing from our shared piggy bank. And also, I found this. Call me old fashioned, but last time I checked, that's murder. Substantial evidence. But no worries, I took care of your husband earlier today. Die! Die! I'm gonna go get the scotch.
Jimmy? I think it's happening. It's definitely happening. Now that that's taken care of, back to our love affair. Celebration. So 